Hey guys, in this video we'll be going over the lurker crab. The lurker crab is one of the many types of lurkers that can be found in the world of Jack and Daxter. This type of lurker can be found in the Sentinel Beach area. As the name implies, Sentinel Beach is a beach, a natural habitat for a crab. They can be found inhabiting the sandy areas of the level. The appearance of the lurker crab resembles the real life hermit crab. They have a very large spiralling shell which you can hide inside and you can see it using a claw to raise it up enough to observe its surroundings. The lurker crab's body is a salmon colour with the shell having some pink shades in it as well. It also has some blue markings following the spiral of the shell. The markings are not any language that is known, possibly some form of lurker text or merely just a decorative marking. The shell has also been fitted with a collar and a ring, where a chain could be attached by gold or mire. It does appear that the shell could be separate from the crab altogether, the way that they hold on to it when they're running around. They could potentially find a new shell without a collar on it, the same way a hermit crab finds a new shell when they have outgrown the one that they're currently in. They also share the yellow eyes and spurs on the lower jawline as the other lurkers. One of the main features of the lurker crab is the two large claws that they use to attack the player. When they go in for the attack, they pop out from their shell and start charging while snapping their claws. After a short period of time, they will keep pursuing the player, but go back inside their shell. If they land a hit, they will go fully inside their shell, remaining stationary, until they wander off and then repeat the attacking cycle. To combat this you just need to land one hit, however you can only deal damage when they are outside of their shell. If you attack when they are using their shell as a defense, they will be pushed backwards, spinning around in a circle and then they are open to attack again. There is a couple of ways to damage the lurker crab while it is hiding inside its shell, and that is to use the cannon. You can either go up to the top of the tower and shoot down yourself, or randomly a lurker will shoot down and hopefully it will land close enough to the crab to do some damage. You can also do the dive attack to take them out while they are hiding inside. Even though the lurker crab is a fairly basic and easy to defeat enemy, they are very well designed and have a fun combat system. That's my overview on the lurker crab, thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next one.